Does measuring estrogen levels in a modified natural cycle before embryo transfer have any impact on the chances of success? So this was a major study of looking at the level of estradiol right before frozen embryo transfer and whether it affects the success rates in women undergoing IVF, which is a modified natural cycle, frozen embryo transfer, where you use ovulation to give progesterone levels. So that is another way of doing an embryo transfer. This research involved a huge group of women, 11,000 embryo transfers, more than 9,000 women in a reproductive center in China. Researchers divided the cycles into five groups based on estradiol levels measured up to ovulation. The main outcome was looking for babies being born, that's live birth rate, with secondary outcomes, including positive pregnancy tests, confirmed clinical pregnancies and miscarriages. They looked at factors such as age, body mass index, infertility duration, embryo quality and treatment year. And what they find was very striking, regardless of whether estradiol was low, moderate or very high, the odds of a live birth rate remained identical, 38 to 41 percent, with no statistical differences. All other pregnancy-related outcomes showed no meaningful difference between the groups. What does that mean for clinical care? First, it suggests that clinics do not need to cancel or postpone the embryo transfers when estrogen levels are low. Again, it's in a modified natural cycle and routine measurements of estrogen before transfer may, may not be necessary with regular cycles. This could in fact lower stress levels and give a more clarity into how we can proceed with treatments. Why is this study reliable? Because it's, it is backed by a huge sample size with good statistical adjustment and subgroup checks, such as focusing only on younger women. However, it's a retrospective study from a single center and we can't guarantee that the results will be seen the same everywhere. So we need more studies, but this does give us an idea that it pushes us understanding whether estrogen measurements may really help to make a decision of success or not just before the embryo transfer in a modified natural cycle.